got over there. We got Reinhardt making a delivery, man. Food service guy. Reinhardt getting to the money. They're in the caves. Shout out to Reinhardt, man. Last stop, guys. Last stop. Let me get back to work here. All labels facing out for the new guys. Label, label. I already scanned these two labels first because that's my base. But all the labels facing out, man. Label on the top here, but that's the top case. And look. We ready to go ahead and roll this load in. Easy. Easy peasy, man. Easy like one, two, three. Just remember to keep them labels facing out, man. Labels facing out. Another stack. Another stack ready to go. We're in the freezer right now, man. We're in the freezer. Not too many cases left. That's the freezer. And uh, it's the rest of the dry. The rest of the dry already took a little bit of dry in. Um, Cause I had to take some of it off in order to get to the bulkhead and uh, open up the bulkhead and get to the freezer. So sometimes you'll have the bulkhead doors and uh, yeah, for whatever reason, it's not attached. Usually the bulkhead doors is attached all the way, you know, both sides of the door. But sometimes you'll catch it like that and you just gotta slide the little door off. And you see the other side still, still on. Somebody, uh, you know, obviously tore it off. But you know, it still serves its purpose, man. So let me get these cases in. Check it with y'all in a second, man. Oh, and let me say that. Uh, just in case you're wondering why, man, why you put some dry in and then went to the freezer. So in this particular stop, so you'll find out that you have some stops where you may have to do the cooler first, um, just based on how the uh, location is set up and where you gotta take uh, cases to, right? So in this particular stop, you do the cooler first, and then you do the freezer, right? And the reason you do that is the cooler is separated from um, the freezer in the dry area, so it's easy to get to the cooler, you don't have no issues, but the freezer, if you put all the dry in first, you can't get to the freezer, right? You'll block the freezer. Um, so that's why you have to do cooler and then freezer, and then you do your dry last, right? So once you get your freeze in, it doesn't matter if that little walkway is blocked because you already got the freeze in place. So you'll find out, you new guys, that some locations, you may have to deliver the cases differently based on how everything is set up, right? Every stop isn't the same, meaning you don't take cooler, freezer, and dry in the same way at every stop. You may have to do freezer first. You may have to do dry first. It just, it just all depends on the stop, man. So... That's just something for you new guys to know. And y'all y'all will find that out um, as you as time go along, you guys will find that out. But let me get these cases in here. Check that with y'all in a minute. So this is the last little bit of the dry right here. You can see I got a few or two miscellaneous items in the back back there by the door, but it's pretty much the last load, man. So we knock this out. Still got um see we still got Reinhardt over there. Reinhardt. Reinhardt still making his delivery man. So I don't know. I think they probably put a lot of cases in over there. 
because usually they always get here before me, but I leave before them. So they probably get um, a lot of cases over there. This stop that I'm at, they normally get anywhere between 90 and 100 and uh, like 27 cases. So not very many. <clears throat> so I kind of be in and out of this stop. But yeah, man. But this pretty much it. Just wanted to um, show you guys this little last little stop. And um, look. Got one case to sell right there. <clears throat> but that's it, man. Remember, um, new guys, definitely remember to keep your labels facing out, man. You don't want to have to get your load all loaded up, stacked nicely, and then you got to go back from side to side, scanning labels and stuff like that. Try to keep them all on one side if you can. Just save yourself a little bit of work, man. And that's it, guys. Listen, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and drop a comment if you got some comments. You already know I appreciate your support. Until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.